I'm Sergeant First Class Patricia Morgan from the United States Army Band Pershing's Own, and today I'll be discussing finger transitions between the notes D, C, and B flat in the bass clef staff. Let's review the fingering for each note. To play D, keep the whisper key down and add the first and second fingers to the uppermost and second holes at the front of the instrument. To play C, Keep the whisper key down, first and second fingers down, and add the third or ring finger. Now to play B flat, you keep down the whisper key, the first, second, and third fingers, and then you add two fingers in the right hand and the uppermost thumb key. So if you were going to make a little rabbit shadow puppet, that's kind of what you're going to need to do to play a B flat. You're not going to put down your ring finger and pinky in the right hand, but you will put down your first and second fingers and your thumb. To find that B flat key on the bassoon, it's the uppermost thumb key for your right hand. In order to transition from note to note, make sure you keep the whisper key down and the fingers relaxed yet secure. Leave the previous notes fingers down if you are descending. To move quickly between these notes, keep the fingers close by, not pointed out away from the instrument. Practice your transitions from note to note slowly and make sure your fingers stay secure while covering the holes. To play things that are quick, we first need to practice slowly so that the movement is smooth and clean. As you get comfortable and the fingering transitions become easier, you'll be able to move quickly. And that is it, that's D, C, and B flat, finger transitions.